Alice Catherine Cleaver, July 5, 1889 to November 1, 1984, was a first-class passenger of the Titanic. She survived the sinking. She was the daughter of Joseph Cleaver, postman, and Lavinia Alice Cleaver, née Thomas. At the time of her birth, the family lived at 42 Marquis Road, Pancras. While she was still in her teens Alice started working as a nursemaid to fashionable English families. In 1911 she was working as a nursemaid in the Harley Street home of the Sargent family. She was later hired by Montreal millionaires, Hudson and Bess Allison, as a last-minute replacement to look after their baby son, Trevor. She boarded the Titanic at Southampton in first class under the Allison's ticket, number 113781. After the collision on the night of April 14, 1912, Alice apparently bundled up the infant in her charge and went off to second class to round up the rest of the Allison household. Alice boarded lifeboat 11. Bedroom steward William Faulkner held baby Trevor while Alice got in. Although there is no firm evidence, it seems certain that the Allisons were unaware that Cleaver had taken the child off safely. The next day, Alice Cleaver and Sarah Daniels realized that they, along with Trevor and the cook, Mildred Brown, were the only survivors of their party. When she arrived in New York with the child, Alice avoided talking to reporters by telling them her name was Jean. After the sinking, she returned to England and on June 22, 1918 she married widower Edward James Williams, a clerk, later a surgical appliance manufacturer. They had two daughters. Although she reportedly never talked about the sinking, she is listed as a contributor to Walter Lord's research for a night to remember, as Mrs. A.C. Williams. At the time of Alice's death on November 1, 1984, she was the last surviving servant passenger of the Titanic. Thank you for listening, and if you would like to hear more biographies like this, please leave a comment below and perhaps give a thumbs up and subscribe to help my channel. Thank you again for listening.